After a year's delay, the Tokyo Summer Olympics are set to proceed. The world's best athletes will once again compete in the pool, on the track, around the velodrome and high above the trampoline. But the circumstances will be most unusual. Here's what you should know about the Games. When are the 2020 Summer Olympics taking place? Postponed a year because of the coronavirus pandemic, the opening ceremony and end August 8 with the closing ceremony. Some events, such as the softball and the men's and women's soccer tournaments, begin July 21, before the official start of the Games. What do the medals look like? Each athlete that reaches the podium will be awarded with a unique Olympic prize. The medals in Tokyo are made from recycled cell phones and other electronics. In February 2017, Tokyo 2020 organizers began soliciting donations from the public for their old electronics, and the gold, silver and bronze was extracted and utilized to forge the medals. What do the Olympic rings mean? The five rings, of blue, yellow, black, green and red, date to 1912, and were designed by de Calberton. The colors were chosen so that every flag in the world would have at least one matching color. The reason there are five rings is murky, they may represent the five populated continents or the five Olympic Games that had been staged at the time they were designed. There is no particular meaning for any individual ring. How will the coronavirus affect the Olympics? Organizers promised an Olympics that looks and feels different than previous Summer Games, but key details were in flux for months. In March, Tokyo 2020 officials said only Japanese spectators will be allowed, and in June they said attendance would not exceed 50% of a venue's capacity. They decided in early July that marathon and race walking events would take place with no spectators before announcing on July 8 that there would be no ticketed spectators allowed at any of the stadiums or Olympic venues. Will there be any people in the stands? Not many. Spectators have been barred from most events, a decision made two weeks before the Games after a new state of emergency was declared in Tokyo in response to rising coronavirus cases. Organizers had already announced in March that most international visitors would not be allowed to come to Japan for the Olympics. That will mean mostly empty stadiums and an eerie atmosphere familiar to American fans who watched baseball, basketball and other sports during the height of the pandemic. What's the schedule for the Olympics? The first medals will be handed out July 24, followed by more than two weeks of dizzying action. Swimming and gymnastics likely will take center stage in the opening week. Swimming competition runs July 24, August 1, and gymnastics is July 25, August 3. Track and field events begin July 30 and conclude with the men's marathon August 8, the final day of the Olympics. Many Olympic tournaments run nearly the duration of the games, including basketball, baseball, softball, volleyball, water polo, soccer, and beach volleyball, and don't award medals until the final days.